Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So on today's video, I am going to do a long, I wouldn't say long awaited because how would you guys know that you were waiting for this? I'm going to be doing a review on a particular tote. I'm a tote girl. I'll always love totes. I've been slowly getting into backpacks, but deep down inside, like I love totes. And this is the first time that I purchased a tote from this brand. So let's get started. This is the Tory Burch Ella Tote in Patent Leather, I believe. If I miss the word, I will annotate it on the screen. <laughs> so this is my Tory Burch Tote and it is a nylon and patent leather bag. I got it at Nordstrom and I think I paid, honestly do not remember how much I paid for her. I think like two or three hundred dollars, I want to say if I'm not mistaken. This is the Tory Burch Ella in large in patent leather. Just for the sake of the video, I do have a purse organizer in here because she is one of those bags that it's, it's, it needs a purse organizer. <laughs> so this is the purse organizer I have in here, but without the purse organizer, this is what it looks like. Like, you have to hold it up. It's not going to really stand up without the purse organizer. So because it's so dark inside as well, and because it's like a nylon bag, I do prefer to have it with my purse organizer. So <laughs> I've carried this bag for such a long time and I've moved into other totes, but this is a good tote for work, I would say. I would say if you live in a climate where it rains a lot or there is snow or any type of inclement weather, that this is good to carry because it's easily wipeable because of the material. It's like a, a PVC type of material and it's just like, it's not gonna get anywhere because it's not leather, it's not pebbled leather, Safiano, whatever. It's <laughs> it's nylon. You can literally take a baby wipe or a Lysol wipe and wipe the bag off. Um, so when you open the bag, here's the front where that big Tory Burch patent uh, logo is. And there is a pocket here. I have a spray hand sanitizer in here because I carry a hand sanitizer in every single bag that I own. <laughs> um, and then here on the back, there is a zip pocket right here that just says Tory Burch here in gold. Oh, I think I still have the plastic on here. That's random. And then on the side, it does snap. So there are some snap pulls here. And when you snap it, it kind of gives the bag like a little bit more structure, a little bit more shape, but not that much because look at what we're working with okay anyways so i'm gonna kind of show you guys what you can fit in this bag um i'm gonna do it without the purse organizer just because it'd be easier to transfer so i'm transferring out of my coach signature tote leopard tote bag this is brand new i just did a video on it so stay tuned for that i'm transferring out of my coach tote to my tory birch tote to go back into my coach tote if that makes sense because i really don't feel like carrying this right now like i get in my moods where i have like i have to be in a certain mood to carry a particular bag and i am not in the mood to carry this I'm not in the mood to carry her so i'm just doing this to kind of show you guys what fits in the bag like what i carry on a day-to-day -day when i carry this bag i'm not going to do it with the purse organizer i'm just going to show you what i have so this is my setup for my coach bag and i'm just going to transfer everything that's in there in here that is the reason why i love totes because it's just easily transferable so starting from the back i have my coach notebook and floral vintage rose print i have my planner i have one of my catch-alls this is a hello kitty catch-all that i got from amazon i have another catch-all from tote that's my other pouch i have my hello kitty girly pouch 
this is like my lady pouch for all your lady needs <laughs> let's stick that there and i have my louis vuitton victorine and rose ballerine i have my juicy couture statement the boss something wallet i can't remember the name but i'll put it down below <laughs> And I carry my receipts in here. And then I have this super cute coffee um, coin pouch that I use to put all my coins. And I'm just gonna put that right here. So everything is pretty much in the bag so far. And I just have three more things to put in my bag. And that is my Louis Vuitton six ring key holder. And then I have my coach key holder that I love so much is actually better than the Louis Vuitton one but we will talk about that another day and then I have my airpods which has like a little floral case and I dumped that in there and here is the bag completely full the only thing I would add to this bag on a day-to-day -day is like for work and stuff I would have my water bottle in here and maybe i would add like a charm or something here to the front but here is the bag here's the bottom no feet just patent leather for the most part it has like leather corners patent leather corners on all the four corners of the bag nothing on the back and if you wanted to you could snap close the sides and carry her like so. So this is the Ella, no structure <laughs> whatsoever. That's why I'm like, I kind of don't want to carry this for a while because I've gotten so accustomed to structured bags that sometimes carrying Ella just be like, girl, you are doing too much. Like you are doing too much right now. The straps are pretty comfortable on here. It's just, it's a slouchy toe and I feel like that makes the bag feel a lot heavier in my opinion. But this is the Ella tote. It is a beautiful bag. I like it. I mean, at first I was like, it doesn't look like much for the price, but it does. It does fit quite a bit. Like it fits a lot. This would be an amazing travel bag. Um, this would be a great mommy bag just because of all the space you have but just because of how like flimsy and unstructured it is i just don't feel like carrying her right now because i don't feel like being bothered but this is a tory birch ella and i think i've had her for probably a year and a half but i like her she's cute she's cute whatever i love tory birch i was like on a tory birch frenzy a few months ago but now I'm on a coach and juicy couture frenzy. Like I don't even, we'll talk about that in another video. I just wanted to show you guys my bag and how much stuff it can fit in it. And that is all. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down below. If you have this bag, let's chat it up in the comments. What do you like? What don't you like? Like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.